They told me before the end of this year. Okay. So it's a guarantee. Yeah, no, I yeah, totally understand. Um, well, that's actually something I would have to talk to Yes, you're smiling. You smile. Let's see you how much room it is. is. Yeah, it's a nice, a nice amount of room. <laughs> nice little room in the third row. Get in the G wagon for sure. I would just find a way where they could put the TV back here. Put the I like this one though. I like this steering wheel. I like this. Is this heated? Uh, the steering wheel is not heated, no. Because of these features? Because the carbon fiber, yeah, it's just the AMG. Okay, well that's fine. I like this. I like this. I'm surprised you didn't say it's because it's not white. I no, thought you were going white. Nice in this color. And with the night package and everything, and everything mm -hmm. just being blacked out on it. Right. It does make the gray really pop. It does. This is nice. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But other than that, everything, you know, your Mercedes Me with the remote start and everything, the controlling off your phone and all that, that comes with the vehicle. Rocketeer airliner. That's, so these seats can only be put up from back here. Yeah. Question. They don't lose this. So there's no car like this where it loses its middle part. So you can have separate seating. So, talking about the uh, captain's chair. Yeah, so on 
most of our GLS models, they do that. I am unsure. I'm unsure if they do that on the 63 model. Um, that's something I could definitely try to find out, see okay. if that's something that can be done. I like that the space that I'm seeing. Because nobody wants to stick. I think they're not in there. I like it nice. Okay. So on this can be configured like... So if I enter like a destination, mm -hmm. it would put the GPS right here in the middle of the... But it's not three different screens, like you just split it up. It's going to be, um, it's just going to be on this screen right here. Okay. So whatever, if you have one thing, one is on that side and one is on this side. Yep. Got yep. you. Yeah. So it's not one continuous screen. So... Um, so that map can be placed on this? Yes, it can be. Um, nobody's entered. But yet. you can't have what you have on that screen, say if you want to do half and half on that side. Say half the map and half the uh, the MP. Um, the RPM. Per, the RPM. Yeah. Okay. Like half um, and half. And then say you have your radio on this side, that whole side. I mean, some. This thing, it looks something like it. I mean, you got the map in the middle, and then you still got your RPM to the right of it. So that's how, like, how it's displayed now. It'll do that, and then also, like, I can change. Oh, it does. All, all of these as well. You got different right. stuff. On, that's what I'm talking about. Oh, okay, okay. So yeah, it's it's almost it's almost the same. Yeah, you can do that, and I can even go over here. I can change this too. That's what I was talking about. Okay, okay. Where you have different stuff. Yeah. Yep. You can do instead of just one on one yep. side and one on the other. See, you can even do like a map like that as well. So that's the biggest uh, the map can go. Yeah. For on on here. Gotcha. Uh, now, if I purchased this, would somebody show me how to work the whole car, even if it took some time? We'll go through the entire thing. Okay. There's not a single thing that we would miss. Okay. And any other questions? We. would Make sure, make sure you want a full understanding of everything. I mean, okay. Yeah. Um, did you want to hop in here and play with any of this? Or? Uh, just wanted to get some video, that's all. Okay, no problem. And then also, okay, so you have your, all your different driving modes in here as well, too. Sorry. Oh, no, you're all good. Don't worry. Um, so you can actually, you can adjust how you're, if you're in manual transmission, your different uh, driving modes and everything. Mm -hmm. You can do, you can increase the exhaust from here. Um, you could even just do it over here, or if you want to go into sport mode or sport plus or race or anything, you could just do it right off here. The same like in the G wagon. Yep. Yeah. So you can do a lot of different um, options from the steering wheel. It's pretty cool. Uh, and then also you have your different height adjustments, your different suspension settings. Uh, this one has your uh, radar adaptive cruise control. So. Um, that's very nice fit as well. Lane, um, Lane, Lane keep assist. assist. And, uh, yep, you have all that with this. Um. In a quarter of a mile, turn slight right onto I-94 West. Now turn slight right. Does the uh, G Wagon have this capability for the augmented video? Yeah. Yeah. I think the 2021. 21s do. Okay, but the 2020 did.
Now, once you hear the car go boop, 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 now you're re responsible for the. So, have your foot near the brake. No, oh, I didn't say brake. Oh, no, no, go ahead. I thought it was going no, to the go car. ahead. Let it go. Let it go. Let it go. Oh, Lord, that scares me. <laughs> <laughs> And you'll be responsible. Once it now you're responsible. You see how you felt that you're doing it? 